Good morning! Happy Sunday! It's actually such a random day to film, but I am currently getting ready because I'm actually gonna get my lashes done for free. So shout out to Brie. Um, yeah, so she's currently taking a lash course and she asked me if I can be her model. So I'm like, hell yeah, I'm down. Call me anytime for that, okay? Come on, lashes, let's go. But yeah, um, I did put a little bit of makeup not on my lashes though um, or my eyelids just like under just cuz I, I my skin is not good right now I haven't been eating properly and I actually haven't gone to the gym for a few weeks now I know let me give you guys an update okay the reason why I've been MIA for a few weeks is actually because I've been apartment hunting because I've decided that I wanted to move out I love my family you know I've lived in this apartment for over is it 20 years now so it's it's time for me to move on i'm 26 going on 27 soon i just want to learn how to be an adult because i've always had my parents help with things and i feel like i just need a fresh new environment which is why i've been mia not only at the gym is because i've literally been obsessed with trying to find an apartment so i will be moving in with obviously my boyfriend we're still looking for a place we did send an application for this one place and we've yet to hear a reply hopefully today um they would let us know if we got it or not let me tell you how much of a struggle it is okay um in canada you need to make at least three times the amount of your actual rent okay so on average right now a one bedroom apartment in canada is around fifteen hundred dollars minimum minimum i do not make three times that amount so as much as i really wanted to do like a high-rise apartment a one-bedroom apartment building realistically since i don't make that much income i decided to just you know look for basement apartments you know at least for private landlords they're more understanding of your situation so that's where i've actually applied to i've applied to a one bedroom basement apartment if we're gonna look at a basement i want that basement to just be ours fully no shared rooms just one bedroom and that is fully our space because i'm a loud person i love filming i love vlogging and i will get a very if we have a roommate it's good that i can be myself when i get my own place i'll probably give you an update once they respond but i've given them a really good impression when we toured their place i made them laugh come on now y'all know how i am come on i get along with everybody <laughs> hello hello update on your girl it is currently nighttime oh my gosh is it gonna fall let's check yeah look at my lashes she just did them this is actually her first time doing it right like i'm literally her first client like i was her live model and honestly not bad for like a first time right anyways um so oh, it's already night time and i'm just i'm a little bummed out because i did find out during the day that we didn't get approved for the basement apartment that i really wish we got um there was no issues with us they actually really loved us it's just they chose to give it to someone that they kind of knew in their circle of friends just because that person was new to canada and they have no credit so they're still you know trying to build up um their credit and whatnot so it's very understandable why they would choose them it's fine now i'm back to just <sighs> looking for another place it's really frustrating like if y'all know how much i freaking searched for places i called probably at this point i called like a hundred places and i still haven't found one but um i will be viewing a place tomorrow um yeah it's just it sucks hello happy monday 
Uh, I just finished work like an hour ago and I'm currently on my way to pick up my mans because we are going to be viewing two potential basements um yeah and it's back to back so I'm so blessed and grateful that I have the car today because lord knows I would not be making the second one because literally um the first apartment the basement apartment is at 6 45 and then the second one is at 8 30 and they're quite far from each other so like i did not want to take the uber like come on now uber is expensive nowadays so that's what's gonna happen i just hope i get it to be honest at least one of them because this is literally taking over my life my mind my work mind too like i'd be at work just scrolling sometimes when i have free time during my lunch like i don't even eat i'm just searching inquiring all day every day which is like annoying it's a little gloomy outside if you can't tell literally see um it's hella gloomy it's monday let's have a good day Let's have a good start to our week and find the damn place. Yep, we're doing that. That's then. How do they? Oh, yeah, I don't even know. So we'll see. We'll see yeah, how this goes. Something like it's impossible. Like, it's impossible. <laughs> so why don't you get that done? Figure that out first. I mm -hmm. think that's the best situation. Okay. <sighs> My gosh, life. It's literally the next day. I couldn't really show um the place just because i was a little embarrassed to like film or whatever the first place it was actually pretty good it was pretty it was small but like the bedroom was spacious i would say there was a lot of storage so that's like a really good thing about it in terms of our situation i don't know if he'll accept it the second place does not match with like what we saw online um it was actually really bad Okay, no, I'm being dramatic. It wasn't super bad. There are just things that could be fixed in the apartment. And every time we brought it up, it's like, oh, is this going to be fixed or whatever? The real estate agent was kind of like blaming the tenants or whatever. But I honestly don't think it's the tenant's fault. Like, when you look at the pictures, like, the previous tenant, ooh, their place was nice. Most likely, I wouldn't want to apply to that place. But yeah, like, that's been my week it's literally only tuesday and i'm going through this right oh my gosh i'm i need to buy more i'm literally running out i think i've been literally saying this the whole vlog like i've i'm just stressed i'm so focused on finding a place as soon as possible just because i just want to start a new life like i know having a different place and moving out isn't really like something where you actually have a new life again but it is a good way to just you know just have a fresh mind once again i know i can't run away from my problems but i'm hoping that if i have my own space my own environment will that help me grow even more as a person right i never know if i don't take that step and i feel like having my own space will give me just the opportunity to be more creative and be more free be myself right um i get to you know be creative in how i design my own place i get to actually film in every corner of my own place because i'm the one who decorated i'm the one who's actually taking care of my home it's not just not a room in itself i'm hoping the goal to move in to a place would be june 1st um that's why i'm literally just always checking an apartment or a basement every day <laughs> like waste of my commute money let's be real but it's reality <sighs> we need to talk all right please don't mind my messy bedroom i like i said before my mind <coughs> has been all over the place but let's just let's just reiterate what happened here last time i saw a place was literally two days ago honestly i was losing hope i was getting frustrated and i just i didn't want to look anymore everything was expensive 
like $1,400, $1,500 is not enough for me to just get my own place. But I decided to go to buit.ca. So I'm on this website and I found this one place, super beautiful, and it was way cheaper than I expected. It, and like, it was just so hard to believe, I would say. I was like, hmm, I need to check this place out because this sounds kind of sus. Obviously, what I've been doing because I've realized I've been wasting my time just viewing all these places, I decided to inquire and, you know, tell them my situation um, rather than like see a viewing and, you know, moving and then telling them my situation and then they wouldn't accept me. So based off how much the place was, like the basement and the utilities that are included, um, as well as how much they would charge for, let's say, including the internet in it. I'm like, okay, this is too good to be true. I need to check this place out though as soon as possible because if it is all real, like, I would want to put like that deposit in right away, right? I want to apply and just send my deposit in. Originally, I was going to schedule a viewing for tomorrow but then after i talked to my boyfriend i'm like i realized you know what this is such a good opportunity i don't think i'll find any better options out there with such a good price we need to check this out like tomorrow aka today like as soon as possible let's reschedule and hopefully they'll take us in tomorrow um because we were just really interested we checked the place out and it was exactly like it was in the pictures and the space was like big and it was just it was such a beautiful home and the landlords are such lovely people like i I vibe with them so well and I can literally see them being a second family because they're just so, they're so humble, they're so like just genuine people. Of course, we're just like, we want this place for sure, how do we apply? Because I was literally like, I have the money, I have the money, I'm ready to, you know, like I'm prepared if, if you accept us, right? And they did they approved us right then and there i was like preparing for this day the day of the viewing like i was listening to my gospel music i was praying to the lord and i'm like the lord really just answered our prayers and our blessings right now i don't know if i'm gonna end it here um but if i do um i just want to say thank you guys for watching my videos let me know if you guys want more moving vlogs because i genuinely enjoy watching moving vlogs so yeah i will definitely post stuff like that join me join me in my journey of now being an adult to be honest like it's time it's time for me to pay my own bills yay i'm excited i am so excited okay anyways i hope you have a great day i love you guys bye